All right, Shalom. This is part three of the dietary law, oral and written. We're going to start at Leviticus 11 and 10. All right. It says, and all that have not fins and scales in the seas. As a matter of fact, hold on. Salak you. Starting at verse nine. Leviticus 11 and 9, it says, These shall ye eat of all that are in the waters. Okay, meaning what? In the ocean, in the sea, in the rivers, the ponds. It says, These shall ye eat of all that are in the waters. Whatsoever have fins and scales in the waters, in the seas, and in the rivers, them shall ye eat. Okay, so what are the qualifications of, of the, uh, the, the fishes, okay, of the beasts that are in the seas? It says, it says, whatsoever has fins and scales, all right, whatsoever has fins and scales, we can eat, all right? Verse 10, it says, and all that have not fins and scales in the seas and in the rivers of all that move in the waters and of any living thing which is in the waters, they shall be an abomination unto you. Uh, verse 10 in the NLT, it says, but you must never eat animals from the sea or from rivers that do not have both fins and scales. They are detestable to you. This applies both to little creatures that live in shallow water and to all creatures that live in deep water. All right. So let's let's look at um, let's look at some um. Fishes. With. Fins. And scales. All right. I wish the font wasn't so small. Can't even see this. Uh, but basically, a, a fish with fins and scales. All right, they they look exactly like this. All right, your 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 trout. Okay, your your bass, all right, your, your salmon, you know, which Jake is, for some reason on social media, has been going crazy over lately, but ain't nothing wrong with that because the salmon is lawful, all right? Um, You got your, your carp, your salmon, and, and another thing, so this catfish, right? This catfish, right? It does, this is unlawful to us, all right? It's a bottom feeder. It does not have scales, so... To you jakes out there, you know who you, 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 um, you jakes out there, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, all right, we're not supposed to be eating this catfish, all right, this is unclean to us, because what, it doesn't have scales, it does have fins and a tail, okay, but it did not, it does not have, um, it does not have scales, okay, the catfish does not have scales, all right, and, and it's a bottom feeder, so we're not supposed to be eating it. It has like this um this uh this slick rubbery texture and coating or around his body. Alright. And once again, this is this is also a bottom feeding fish. Alright. This yeah, this one too. I I ugh. Goodness grief. Yeah, we, we're not supposed to be in fishes that, that look like this. This is unclean to us. All right, because what? It doesn't have any scales. It has fins, but it doesn't have any scales. The lung fish. All right, so we're not supposed to be eating that. All right, so even among your fishes, even though some of them may look like you really got to pay attention. All right, and just because catfish is common among you, common among us, doesn't mean that we should be eating it, no matter what the situation. Okay? So let's go back to the law. It says, and all that have not fins and scales in the seas and in the rivers of all that move in the waters and of any living thing which is in the waters, they shall be an abomination unto you. Okay. It says, they shall be even an abomination unto you. You should not eat of their flesh, but you shall have their carcasses an abomination. Yes, so it says um you must never eat their meat or even touch their dead bodies. Yeah, their carcasses, man. Okay, so we we we're not supposed to have anything to do with them because they're unclean to us. All right? 
It says, Whatsoever hath no fins nor scales in the waters, that shall be an abomination unto you. All right. So, sea creatures without fins and scales. All right. So, let's go to clam. Because Jake loved this shit as well. All right. Especially, especially the, the, especially the nigga woman. The nigga woman love, love, uh, uh these, these so-called delicacies of seafoods. All right. So the clam, we, we are not supposed to be touching this. Okay. But here it is. You got clam chowder. All right. And clams include, uh, include, uh, uh, mussels. Okay. Uh, scallops. All right. Let me see, um, mussels, right? Mussels, all right, same thing. It doesn't have fins. It doesn't have scales, okay? It lives in shallow water. You know, some in the depth as well. Um, oysters, all right, all of these, all of these shellfishes, we are not supposed to be touching these damn things, man, all right? But leave it to Jake. He'll eat them raw. He'll he'll eat them steamed. All right, fried crabs. All right, we're not supposed to be touching these things because they don't have um they don't have scales or fins. All right, and the scriptures are very precise about what it goes into. It says, "Whatsoever hath no fins nor scales in the waters, that shall be an abomination unto you." All right, it's detestable. It's it's a filthy animal. Okay? Lobster. Look, man, we we're not supposed to be touching these things. And when you look at the makeup of a lobster, all right? It looks like a scorpion, right? The the bug that's on the land. Okay? Here's a good picture. You got the lobster right here, right? And you got the scorpion right here. You gonna sit here and tell me these things don't look alike? It's the same thing. It just one is in the water and one is on land. And you got the spider. What sea creature does the spider look like? Spiders. Crabs. Okay. And you also have a spider crab. All right, which is further rubbing it in your face. Let me see, um, spiders and crabs. Okay. Yeah, look at this. Are you really gonna Are you really gonna sit there and tell me that this don't look like a damn spider? This is a crab. This is a crab. This is a crustacean. Okay. This is a crab. Are uh, you not about to say and tell me that this don't look like a don't look like a spider? One last one. Shrimp and roaches. Okay? Notice none of these, okay, none of these have scales and fins. All right? Same family, shrimp cockroach they're in the same family once again one just lives in the uh in the waters and the other one lives on land would you eat a cockroach would you eat a palmetto bug absolutely not on land would, would you eat any of those absolutely not okay look are shrimp related to cockroaches okay believe it to jake but man i love me some jumbo fried shrimp you know I, I love me some shrimp, some shrimp and butter, some shrimp scampi. You know, it's like, uh, <laughs> matter of fact, hold on. Let me see if I can find that shit. It's fucking wicked. It was a funny movie, though. It was a funny movie. I feel like uh, somebody already know. Um, Bubba Gump shrimp scene. All right. On the Forrest Gump movie. <laughs> Have the power to make more good in the all-new Sportage Turbo Hybrid. Kia. Movement that inspires. I didn't know who I might meet or what they might ask. 
Have you ever been on a real shrimp boat? <laughs> no. But I've been on a real big boat. I'm talking about a shrimp catching boat. I've been working on shrimp boats all my life. I started out on my uncle's boat. That's my mama's brother. When I was about maybe nine. I was just looking into buying a boat of my own and got drafted. My given name is Benjamin Buford Blue. People call me Bubba. It's like one of them old redneck boys. Can you believe that? My name's Forrest Gump. People call me Forrest Gump. So Bubba was from Bio the Battery, Alabama. Too. Oh, let me get to the part. Bubba's the, family uh... answer every question. With... Go now. There's some simple your weapon and continue. There's pineapple shrimp, lemon shrimp, coconut shrimp, pepper shrimp, shrimp soup, shrimp stew, shrimp salad, shrimp and potatoes, <laughs> shrimp burger, shrimp sandwich. That's that's about it. That's that's about it. All right, but <laughs> get to the point. It's like it. That just popped up in my head. Okay. Jake make all of those meals, man. All all uh, Jake Jake eats all of that, and then and then call it a damn delicacy. All right. Well, hey, and this is why. This is why there's the righteous, and this is why there's the wicked, man. Because you know the prophets were out telling you, and were out giving you the law. All right, you're not supposed to be touching certain foods, man. Okay. That was the um, that was the point on that. All right. This is part three. On to the next one.